Hey guys, um, so today we're going to be reviewing the Gorilla Carts. I live in an apartment now and I wanted something that's going to be multi-useful for carrying stuff into the apartment, but also I wanted something that is versatile so that if I ever want to do anything else, I don't know, fishing or something, that I have something that can cater to that, you know. And I want something that would long last. So I found the Gorilla Cart. So I'm gonna be doing a product review on this and I'll show you how that goes. Um, enjoy this time lapse. Overall, the cart arrived brand new. I didn't see any defects. All the zippers are working. All these straps do uh, lower. Uh, I would note that there is, this is not removable. You can, there is one part that has a zipper and you could unzip that so that you can load this pocket much easier and then re-zip it. I don't know how you want to do that. Um, or if you think that just lowering this down would be enough. That way you don't have to struggle with re-zipping the cart. But um, just I just wanted to make sure that this is not removable. You can open it wider, but that's about it. Um, I did have an issue with this part. Um, it wasn't fully sealed down. I'm going to try to get a better angle or a better focus of it for you. There you go. Um, it's just sticking out. Uh, it is rough and it is made of the same material as this and it's just sticking out, you know, and I, I, I know that whenever I put this out, eventually I'm going to run my hand across of it somehow or my arm's going to scrape against of it and I'm going to get a little, uh, I'm going to get scratched by this. So I, I think I might sew it down so that it is more flush and I won't have to deal with that. So here are some things I don't like about it. So first off, the Velcro, um, the clip-on is great. I do not like that there's no, it's not locked in place, you know? This thing could just easily slip out. I don't want to lose it because it would make putting this, the cover on it very pointless. So I'm thinking that I'm gonna sew this part down so that it does not move it at all. I won't lose it and it's, it'll be more secured. Check this out. Um, I mean, you could pull it up. It has a nice grip adhesive right here. So, not adhesive, but like rubber. So like you have a pretty nice grip. It does, you can lower it by pressing this button. Just be careful when you lower it. It does make a really annoying sound as you go down. I'm gonna try to see if I can do this. There. I press the button, I'm gonna push it down now and you hear the sound. Ooh, like that's, ooh, that's, that's bad. But anyway, this part kind of makes up for it. It has this nice little swivel. It bounces back and forth, making turns really nice. Uh, the wheels do lock, except uh, these are unfortunately plastic. And I was hoping that it'd be rubber. It'd be nice to have rubber, rubber wheels on this, but, um, for a hundred bucks, I think this is a solid purchase so far. I have not yet had a chance to test it with weights. Um, and I'm hoping it held up fine. Definitely I'm gonna be taking this a lot for grocery runs and I'm, I'm hoping that I can get my value for this. And I'm very excited to test this out and hopefully leave a positive review. The other thing that might be worthy of noting is make sure that when you collapse the cart that your wheel, the lock is on the inside as how it, it came. I swapped it around earlier just to test out the brake and I had a trouble, I had trouble closing it. <laughs> or uh, if you can see from the time lapse, I had trouble putting the cover back onto 
a cart. So I'm hoping that with this, it will close night, uh, much easier. I would like to also add that when you're putting the cover back onto the cart, try to put the handle side on, uh, try to do it on the ground where you lay the board flat on the ground and you have, and then you place the, the handle part down first onto the mat and then you wrap it like a burrito or a spring roll, however you want. And then uh, it, I found it easier to apply the clips and it was easier to put away. Thanks for watching guys. And uh, if you like this video, please uh, subscribe, leave a comment, like, uh, and tell me what you think. You know, I hope that my review helped you to possibly decide on a cart. I know that I looked around for a while and a lot of the carts, they just generally had, you know, uh, the foldable ones are just open, close, open, close. I wanted to, I mean, if I'm spending that much money already for like, I don't know, like 60 to 70 bucks, uh, I might as well try to find one that would have more features. And I think that the Gorilla cart is a, would be a great value if it holds up. So I'm hoping that it holds up and yeah. Um, thank you for watching. Bye guys.